All right, so step one in your vision board party, travel themed, obviously is to plan your party, right? What does that mean? Well, what, what is it that you wanna do? We want to determine in this planning step, do you want to have a live event or do you wanna have a virtual event? And let me tell you, if you have a virtual event, obviously more people can join and more, you know, more time that you can have to have people there. But I love live events because you get to touch the people, you get to see the people, you get to interact with people, People. And I think as we are, um, we are online entrepreneurs, it becomes easy for us to forget that we are actually working with human beings that are bodies, right? So having a live event, I think would be a great local thing for you to do. In this first step, what you are doing is planning, are you going to do it? Then, you know, how are you going to deliver it? Are you going to do it, deliver it live or are you going to deliver it virtually? Now, if you've never delivered a virtual um, event, I don't want you to be scared because it's super easy. It's not, it's not going to be any different than you doing. It actually, to me, is easier because, right, you know, you could be dressed up really nice in the top part and the bottom part, you could be in your pajamas. So you could actually host your, I'm not in my pajamas in the bottom, but you could actually host an event and be in your pajamas um, doing the event. Maybe you could do a pajama themed party, right? It doesn't matter. You know, have fun with this. Hopefully that's what you're getting out of this message is that this is an opportunity for you to create an event for your travel business that is really fun and gets people jazzed up. So I want you to also have fun with it as well. So step one, plan the party and what you want to do is determine if it's live or if it's going to be virtual. Second part of that planning step is determining what the theme of the event is going to be around. Are you going to do destination? Are you going to do type of travel, right? Maybe destination. Let's say you specialize in Jamaica. Maybe it's going to be a Jamaica themed um, party, right? Virtual a vision board party. And what you'll do is you, when we talk about the future steps, you'll be providing some information about different types of destinations in Jamaica that you, a person could go, give some history about that, and then tell them about that, you know, right? So you could do like a tour of Jamaica as a part of that, and you'd give them some information that they could go to so they could cut out and create the pace of those different areas of Jamaica based on the interest, right? So you wanna decide your theme as a part of the planning, right? Um, is it destination? Is it bucket list specific, right? So all of the places that they wanna go to in their lifetime, maybe all in a particular year, that would be something that you could do around a theme. Tip that I want you to remember as a part of the step one is, is that you want to make sure that you have gotten with your key travel suppliers as a part of this and determine if you can get some brochures, printed brochures, because what you could do is have those printed brochures sent out to your customers who are going to attend, particularly if you're doing a live event. You could send out the um have them available as a part of the live event, and you're gonna want people to cut them up, right? Cut them up and paste them, and when we talk about supplies, have them available, right? So talk to your suppliers. If you are Jamaica, you want to talk to your Jamaica uh, specialist, right? If you are doing cruises and they're going to the Caribbean, you want to have your supplier as a part of this process and ask if you can get brochures. Most of the suppliers that are out there have collateral. Um, and what I mean by that is they have marketing collateral. They have marketing images of all the destinations that they represent. Like um, I was looking at World Caribbean, I think it was at World Caribbean or Norwegian's marketing collateral. They have an entire site dedicated to pictures, right, that you can use in your marketing. So it's not like you've got to go swipe pictures off the internet. You can actually they have a site where you can download those pictures. You could create, if you're doing a virtual event, you could create a zip file of pictures for all of the different destinations that you have and send them to your customers as part of the prep for the vision board party, all right? Hopefully that is making sense to you guys and the creative juices are flowing there um, and you are understanding how you can really put the information together. But key is talk to your suppliers. Let them know what you're doing and find out what type of travel related material you can provide to the attendees of your vision board party, all right? so. 
part of the step two is, is that you want to make sure that they've got images, that they've got magazines, they've got brochures, they've got whatever the theme of your party is going to be about, that you've got plenty of material to give to them as a part of the vision board of saying it, okay?